I was born twice, first as a baby girl in a remarkably smogless Detroit day in January of 1960, and then again as a teenage boy in an emergency room near Petoskey, uh, Michigan in August of 1974. Yeah. I even agree. I lost track after a while, happy, happy to be home, weeping for my father and thinking about what was next. Callie's favorite food would be fasolatha, which is a Greek soup, and she's a Greek immigrant, so that means that she would enjoy that soup, obviously. And she would eat it with a silver spoon. Seeing now, muse of the recessive mutation on my fifth chromosome, seeing I'll bloom two and a half centuries ago on the slope of the Mount Olympus while the gloats bleated and the all dropped, seeing I'll pass down through nine generations, gathering invisibly within the polluted pool of the Sophanes family, and seeing how providence in the guise of a massacre sent the gene flying again, how blew like a seed across the sea to America where it drifted through our industrial rains until it fell to earth in the fertile soil of my mother's own Midwestern womb. Sorry if I get a little America times, that's genetic too. 10 out of 10. The movie would be called Middlesex the Movie. Callie would be Ellen Page. Chapter 11 would be Rowan Atkinson. Clementine Stark would be Kristen Stewart. Obscure Object would be Kate Upton. Jerome would be Taylor Lautner. Eleutherotherios would be Alan Arkin. The said Demona would be Betty White. In the end credits, there would be Radiohead's Creep. Because that's the best Radiohead song ever. I read the book in this chair because I didn't go anywhere else. But I'm a creep. I'm a world What the hell am I doing here? I don't belong here